Hello students, you are most welcome to this video session produced by Gwanda Polytechnic. I'm Donati Hundimana, instructor in the civil engineering department in the IPRS Chigari. The session of today is setting out of a building. Before going forward, let's share the objective of this session. First, at the end of this session, the learners should be able to define what is a setting out of a building. Secondly, at the end of this session, the learner should be able to list out the tools and equipment that should be used in setting out of a building. And thirdly, uh, at the end of this session, the learner should perform a setting out of a building using uh, a square method. So I encourage you to follow the step so that you do a self-evaluation on yourself. Let's have the introduction, the definition of what is a setting out of a building. You must uh, ask yourself, what is a setting out of a building? A setting out of a building is a process of transferring the architectural plan from the drawing to the ground. As you see here, maybe for this plan here we have, this architectural drawing. You see, we have a plan. We have a full plan of a building. As you see here, we have a living room. We have a bedroom. Here we have a bathroom. So, this is one bedroom building. So, we need to transfer this drawing to, to the ground. Simply, let's take the definition of setting out of a building as that. The setting out of a building, it is the work that is done on the site. So we have to wear the personal protective equipment. Let's start with this reflective vest. It must be yellow or orange in order to increase the visibility, which enabling the safety. Also, we have to wear the gloves in order to protect our hands. Also, we have to put the helmet in order to protect our head. Also, you see, you have the overall, I have the safety boot in order to protect my foot. So, let's go in order to see the tools that should be used in setting out. Let's start with this one. We have, we have tape measures in order to measure the distance. In, in short distance, we use this one. When we have to measure the long distance, we use this one. Here we have the split level in order to stretch the horizontality. Here we have the claw hammer. This will be used for fixing or knocking the nails. We have also here the club hammer for hammering the pegs. It is the big one. Here I also have a machete. This one we use it for shaping the pegs. Here also I have a steel square or a builder square. Just this will help us to uh, put a light angle. As you see, put a light angle. Also, we have also building line. The building line, this will help us to demarcate the wall thickness or the trench thickness. So now we come up to see the tools that should be used in setting out. Now we are going to see the material 
that will be used in setting out. Here we have the pegs. Those one, the the pegs. Also, have here the boards. So those boards and those pegs will help us to make the profile board. So we we'll see later. But also, we have the nails. The nails. So we have three categories of material. The, pe uh, the pegs, the, the boards, and the nails. So thank you for this session. Uh, next we'll see how we do a performance of setting out of a building using a builder square method. Thank you.